good afternoon you guys happy friday tgif i am so happy it's friday i'm not sure what's going on but my stomach's been super upset i don't know i think it's the starbucks drinks that i've been drinking low-key i think it's messing with my stomach um but i'm out here today delivering i've been out here a little bit before three today um and i'll probably be out here till about 10 10 30 uh so i'm trying to make that money even though all i want to eat all i really want to do is sleep if you guys are new to my channel my name is marley i do uber eats and doordash videos in central florida i'm out here today in a popka and i've been going with the orders today i don't know since i started i don't think i've sat very long at all i have done a bunch of orders um but my camera was dead and patience was using the charger that seems to be a theme this week um so my first order it was around 225 i took an order for starbucks for two miles for six dollars 25 cents i think i waited like two minutes for that not very long at all and then around 3.22, I took, well, around 2, no, around 3 o'clock, I took an order for Huey Magoo's 3.2 miles for $7. I think I waited maybe about 4 minutes for that one. They were still working on it. They had a bunch of orders ahead of mine. So I had to wait. And then after I dropped that off, I was in Altamont. They gave me a ride for Pillantai, Pillantai. Um, in Altamont to come back to Apopka so I accepted that for four miles for nine dollars and thirty cents that was ready when I went in there and then after I dropped that one off I parked up and then I was sitting for like a minute and I got an order for Chick-fil-a for eleven dollars and forty one cents you guys so y'all know how to take that for 3.5 miles after I dropped that off I was headed back this towards Apopka because I was kind of like 414 I was like almost in Orlando um so I was almost back in Apopka and I got a ride for Firehouse for 3.5 miles for eight dollars and while I was there they sent me an Uber for Firehouse for 1.5 miles for 8.93 going the same way the difference was like half a mile so I was like oh perfect I did both of them and now I'm at Huey Magoo's and DoorDash is calling me Hello? Hi, Marley, right? Yes. Yeah, hi. I'm the food for right now. What was hi, that? Um, I'm the person that you're picking up the food for right now. The DoorDash? Okay, yes. Yeah, hi. Um, I just wanted to turn. Did you grab the food yet? No, I'm here right now to grab it. Okay, perfect, perfect. I caught you. Okay. Can you please, please, please make sure they included, like, the barbecue and the, the honey mustard? Every time I yeah. there, they never include it, and then we have to eat like dry chicken tenders. <laughs> yeah, I'll make sure the sauces okay. are in the bag. Thank you. Thank you. You're welcome. Thanks. Bye. Bye. <laughs> oh, God. Y'all, let me go grab her food. All right, you guys, I verified that her sauces were in the bag, so that was good. I got it delivered, and then as I was walking back to my car, their neighbor's dog came running at me, and I was like, you know, because I don't want, I don't know, it was barking at me, so I didn't want to get attacked either, but she let me pet her, or he let me pet him, I, don't, I wasn't paying attention for all that, and then he went to run up to get the food, I said, ah, ah, ah. <laughs> Then their owner, I think they heard me, so they started calling the dog, or they heard it barking, I don't know. So I'm trying to go in my car, and he's still following me. I'm like, you gonna come with me? <laughs> and then the owners, the kids came out and got the dog, so that was good. I made sure that the dog didn't run off with the food. Um, now I'm headed for my next order. It's for Outback on Uber, and Uber is having a quest, and I think DoorDash has like $3 peak pay right now. Um, so it's like either one is iffy, you know, but my Uber is, I think it was like $9 for three miles or something. What is that person doing? And I did get a little bit more for that ride too. So that's good. Is that my road? No, that wasn't my road. 
I got $10 for that ride, so that's good. This is my road, I think. This one was, this is the ride I'm going for now for Outback. I haven't been to Outback in a long time because it's in Altamont and I don't, I'm not all over here all the time, but that order just brought me here, so I'm here now. All right, you guys, I got the Outback dropped off. It was ready. You know, today, everybody, everywhere I've went has not given me a straw. Luckily, I grabbed a bunch from one of the restaurants that I went into, um, but when I noticed the guy from Outback didn't hand me a straw, I'm like, is there a straw in the bag? So he checked the bag. He's like, oh, let me go get you one. Mm -hmm. I've learned to ask now because it seems like nobody's wanting to give me a straw. Um, but that delivery is done and now I am heading to Little Greek for four miles for $11.41 and it's almost six o'clock so I think I'm doing pretty good. I think I'm probably about $65 already and then this should put me at like 75 ish dollars maybe closer to 80 not really sure because I haven't really been checking um I don't know if all my tips have come through so I'm guesstimating I'm, I, I'm going to be at about 75 once I finish with this ride all right i got the little greek dropped off and i just accepted a doordash order you guys there is three dollar peak pay but i um it would have to be 11.50 for that to have the opportunity to go up this one is 11 dollars for marco's pizza 2.3 miles i'm it's gonna be hard for me to get there because i'm in the left lane to turn and i should be on the outside lane but they sent it to me when i was already in the turn lane so I'm gonna go because the light just turned and I need to try and get over. So I was able to get over for that Marcos order and now I am, let's see, I just dropped off a Chili's one. It was 1.9 miles for $8 and I low-key forgot that there was $3 peak pay. So he only left me a $2 tip and it was a leave at the door but he met me outside so i made sure i took a picture of his house number and put handed to customer thank you for ordering have a great night so not trying nothing on me baby and now i'm heading to chick-fil-a for an order for 3.7 miles for seven dollars and 71 cents and yeah so this should put me this will put me at 107 dollars once I finish with this, and it is 7.15 right now. And after I dropped that off, I got an order for McDonald's at the McDonald's at the other end of Von Club for $9.78. And all they ordered, you guys, was like five hot, five sundaes, three of them hot fudge, two plain, and three McFlurries and a large fry. <laughs> that was their order, and it went half a mile after I picked it up from the McDonald's, so that was good. It wasn't far. And then I just did this one and it took me about probably a half an hour, I would say. I didn't realize it was an order on arrival order. I just saw $13.50 for five miles and I was like, oh, that's okay. Because it's going to come back the way I want to come anyways. So pretty much it was just like, I think like two and a half, three miles to get there. And then it put me right back off a of hunt club, but on the closer side to my, like my parking lot. So I ordered the food and then I let the customer know, hey, I ordered your food. It's going to be about 15, 20 minutes. She was like, oh, it wasn't ready when you got there. So she didn't even know that Uber does order in on arrivals. That was delivered. And now I just got an order for It's Just Wings. <coughs> Excuse me. For 3.8 miles for $9. And then they gave me an add-on for an additional 1.2 miles for $5. So I am about to head there now, you guys, for both of these. And it's about 9 o'clock. I know I did complete two of the quests on Uber. I will not get another one um, just because I did, I took these two DoorDashes. The Ubers they're sending me are super long, so DoorDash um, came through with this one. All right, you guys. Both of those orders for It's Just Wings were ready, so that's good. Um, I dropped both of them off. They were only like a mile apart so that was good and the one went back the way that I came from so that was even better 
Um, the second water did not tip. I forgot there was a peak pay. I didn't realize that I had got the peak pay um, with those orders. I just accepted one. It's a little far just because I have to go back um, back a little bit and then all the way back. So I have to go whoop and then all the way whoop. So it's nine miles, but it's $23. So I am heading to Gators Dockside. I'm not sure if they are both for Gators Dockside. They are for both for Gators Dockside. I'm hoping that they're gonna be ready. It's 9.30, it's not like it's six o'clock and it's like prime time dinner time. Um, plus it is Friday night and I know I said I wasn't going to, but I think last week they did me good and then yesterday they did me good. So hopefully today will be good too. All right, you guys, those orders for Gator do Gators Dockside were both ready, okay? One had to go a little bit to the side and then one the other one had to get dropped off all the way to the back so it really wasn't that bad I was in both the neighborhoods earlier so it's just because they were going opposite directions it was seemed like a long time now I have two more orders for Gators Dockside that I'm heading to it was like 2.3 miles for me just to get back to the Gators Dockside I'm still heading there but it's for another $23, y'all. I am so happy. This will probably be my last order of the night though because it is 10 o'clock, it's 9.59. Um, but let me show you this order really quick. Yep, 23.09, two orders, 5.9 miles, but like I said, 2.3 miles, I mean, $23, 5.9 miles, but y'all see, like how far away I was from the restaurants. So once I get it, it's not that bad at all. Probably like two miles, three miles, less than less than that. So that's exciting. And then I'm probably going to be done. I'm thinking I'm like at 160 right now or 170, 180, I think like close to 180. So this might put me at 200, I don't know. Um, but this is probably gonna be my last story, guys. Hey guys, I am home. If you have made it this far to the video, thank you so much for watching. And if you haven't yet, please hit that subscribe button for me. Um, I'm just gonna go over my totals now and let you guys know if I did any more rides or anything. And I did not. That last um, $23 one for this, the Gators Dockside was my last order. So I did two double orders for Gators Dockside back to back. The first one ended up being a little bit more for $26, and the last one was only the $23. So because that $26 one went up, you guys, I ended up hitting my um, hitting $200. So that's twice in one week, y'all, that I hit $200. I think I hit like 210 cents or something like that. 210 cents. Uh, with Uber Eats is where I made most of the money, you guys. It was $142 for 13 trips. And then with DoorDash, you guys, I did $58 for 7 trips. And that was, I did one trip around 2 something and then my next trip started after 3 o'clock. And then I went till about almost 10.30, I would say. Um, let me see, I can give you an exact time that I was done. 10.25, that's when I finished all my rides. Um, so $200 in that amount of time from like three to 10, I'll say like 2.45 because I did do the one trip. It was two something, I forget what it was. Uh, my mileage today was 98 miles, so a little bit more mileage. And that is because as soon as I hit Apopka and I turned on DoorDash and Uber around two something, I did turn it on, so that's why there is more mileage. Um, I am off this weekend, guys. I hope you guys have a great weekend and you will be seeing this video on Monday. It's going to be a little weird. <laughs> um, I have a community post that went up today. I'll probably put one up tomorrow too. Just reminding everybody 
that my videos are going to be delayed because I have a busy day tomorrow. I have to get up super early and I'll probably be gone all day. Um, but I hope you guys have a great weekend. I hope you have met your goals. I hope you are great in health and financial wise from all this good Ubering and door dashing this week. And I will see you next week. A young boy being may dream. And in the dream... <laughs>